Do not think the traffic jam only happens in streets, roads, and highways. Because in today's video, you will be amazed to see that traffic jams and traffic congestion can also happen in the sea. So, if what I said sounds interesting to you, then watch the video from beginning till the end. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on your notifications. Today, you will be amazed to see the traffic jams and traffic congestions that happen in the sea. And without further delay, let's get right to our number one. Number one is, what's causing the container ship traffic jam? Around the world, some major ports are experiencing a huge influx of containers, resulting in long supply delays. Trade wars, high demand, and a pandemic have created a perfect storm for the container ship industry, which is trying to stay organized in the face of a wave of market unpredictability. The Ever Given, which clogged up in a super important Suez Canal back in March of 2021, was the canary in the coal mine for recent global trade slowdowns. But before this calamity, disruptions from the COVID-19 pandemic hit port after port with the aftershocks hitting the consumer market. Number 2 is Watch How LA's Container Ship Logjam An average of 30 container ships a day have been struck outside the ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach just waiting to deliver their goods. The backlog is part of a global supply chain mess spurred by the pandemic. That means consumers could see delivery delays for weeks. Number 3 is Long Line of Cargo Ships Wait to Dock at Port of Oakland If you're on the Bay Bridge looking south thinking there are a lot of ships in port, you're right. The bay has become crowded with cargo ships with no place to dock. The port of Oakland has been the fullest it has been in years, with numerous ships waiting in San Francisco Bay to dock. The port of Oakland said the increased container traffic is causing bottlenecks up and down the coast, driven, they say, by increased amounts of home shopping during the pandemic. Number 4 is Traffic Jam at the Port of Los Angeles The supply chain crisis has been brewing off the coast of Southern California for many months as massive freighters wait for dock space to open up. Current port delays are near a record high. 33 ships were anchored off the coast waiting for a spot to open up to unload at Los Angeles and Long Beach ports, according to data from the Marine Exchange of Southern California.
Number 5 is cargo ship loses more than 1,800 containers in Pacific storm. The Japanese flag container ship 1 Apis has lost 1,816 cargo carriers after it was caught up in a violent storm in the Pacific. The vessel arrived in the Japanese port of Kobe, where ship owners and managers said a full safety inspection would be carried out. The incident is described as the second biggest cargo loss in shipping history. Number 6 is Ever Given Container Ship finally arrives at Rotterdam. The Ever Given Container Ship, which made world news when it got stuck in the Suez Canal and disrupted global trade, finally arrived at the Dutch port of Rotterdam. The ship docked at Rotterdam's ECT Delta Terminal. It is expected to remain there unloading its cargo when it is scheduled to move on the Felix Toe in the UK. The ship was stuck in the Suez Canal for close to six days. It initially set sail from the port of Yantian, China, before running aground in a crucial passage that accounts for about 12% of seaborne cargo trade. So, I hope you found this video wonderful, and if you did, be sure to like and share this video to others. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.